In this video tutorial, I'm going to share with you a simple crypto trading strategy that you can use to make at least $10 or more on a daily basis trading spot on the BitGet exchange. Alright, so I decided to use the BitGet exchange because with the BitGet exchange, whatever number of volumes you trade on the spot market, it is all with zero fee. It means that you're not paying any fee. So because we are not paying fee, we can be saving more of the profit we make on a daily basis all right so this is a, a beginner guide okay on trading spot with the BitGet exchange you don't need any experience after seeing this video to the end you should be able to start trading and the trading capital for this experiment is just hundred dollar it means that if you have more than hundred dollar you can actually make more than ten dollars in a day all right so with that being said if you are new to the channel you love videos about making money online about crypto trend investing then consider subscribing Hit the notification bell to be the first to be notified each time videos like this are published on this channel okay so everything i'm going to show you in this video i'm going to do it on the mobile app so that you will be able to follow up in case you don't have a laptop or a desktop you should be able to do this on this. now if you don't have an account with bitget already okay use the link in the video description to sign up for one get your account verified and then start implementing this strategy and you can start seeing the result immediately so with that being said let's jump right into it so i'm just going to pull up my app right now okay so um this is what the app looks like very simple app very simple user interface okay so once you log into the bitget app okay this is what it looks like and where our focus is okay is on the menus that you can see below here okay there are menus below here. As you can see here that is a menu um this is for the home page this is for you to assess the market for features for sport and then here you can assess your wallet okay so our focus is just on the spot trading tab so you want to go ahead and click on spot so when you click on spot this is what it brings you to okay here on the spot interface you have your order book all right um these are uh, market makers okay um their orders are the ones you see here on the order book then here this space is where we'll be doing out our buying and selling all right then at the top here is where we can select the coin we want to trade now you're seeing dodge usdt here is because um dogecoin is one of my favorite uh, okay pair when it comes to spot trading i trade this a lot all right and then here down here whenever you deposit funds into your spot into your bitget account you will see them reflecting here now if it is usdt to be showing up here or any other coin you deposit into your account okay so the first thing you want to do is when you come in here to the spot trading interface you want to select the coin you are going to trade now for me personally the coin i trade the most because i have a lower capital okay now this experiment is just for hundred dollars because i have a lower capital all right i'm always trading dodge or the bgb token okay the bgb token is the native token of the big get exchange which is this one here all right um if the, the result or the profit i'll make when i'm trading any of this token either the bgb token or the dodge token will be more with a hundred dollar account than trading btc or literal all right so that's why i prefer going with this because it is a short-term trade i'm not trading for to get results for months or thereabouts so i just prefer to trade either the bgb token okay or the dodge token so once you click on this all right it brings up this list if you don't see any of the token you want to trade here you can go ahead and type in that token for instance if i want to trade ship so i can go ahead and select the ship right now and start trading that particular token all right so once you select that um here on the buy tab beneath it you see the limit order okay by default it to be on the limit order option so majorly i use limit okay market and limit these are the other types that i use market and the limit order these are the ones i use the most I use market order whenever I see an opportunity to buy. All right. Whenever I see an opportunity to buy, I use the market um, order and then use limit order to set that particular asset that I've bought to sell it at a, um, any price of my choice to make profit. Okay. So everything about spot trading is buying low and selling high, buying low and selling high. All right. So we can use this option here to buy. All right. Whenever we buy, we come to the sell tab, use limit order to create that order for a spending so that when you now the price that hits our target will sell that for profit okay so but before then all i do is to use this option when you click on this option here okay this icon here it takes you to the chart for this particular token that you have selected so we want to know when to buy and then know when to sell 
okay so for the dodge token all i need to do is to click there it takes us to the chart all right so once once it brings us to the chart you can do this on any time frame of your choice but i prefer doing this on the one hour time frame okay so you can use any of this time frame you see here you can click on it and go there now when you come in here what you want to pay attention to this is what the chart may looks like yours may be different but one thing i want you to pay attention to is that on the app these are your indicators okay this is moving average this is um um, the moving average exponential this is your bollinger band this is your volume this is your macd okay you have all of these um, indicators down here so if i scroll this to the left you see rsi you see other indicators showing up here all right but in all of the, any of these that you want to be active for instance if i want to use the bollinger bands i just go ahead this is um, the bollinger bands okay so if i want to use it i just go ahead and click on it and you see that it has been added to the chart okay you have the upper band the middle band and the lower band all right um this is called another good indicator but in the spot trading i use only the rsi okay so i want to make sure that i click on the bollinger bands to put it off and then make sure that the rsi is active this is the one we are going to use okay make sure that the rsi is what active so once your rsi is active okay this purple line is what your rsi is what we want to pay attention to all right on the app what you want to pay attention to is this number you are seeing here okay now after the rsi in bracket you see 14 all right when you see 14 the next number is telling you the current position of the rsi and that number is 35 it means that the rsi is where it is currently is 35 okay now this array the default rsi you see here is set at 70 and then 30 when this gets below 30 it means that the market is over what is over sold so when it is oversold, what this rsi is simply telling you is that now that the market has broken below 30 currently we are 35 now that the market has broken below 30 the market can start reversing any moment from now okay because it is at the oversold level now when it goes up to this extent okay it will be above 70 so you can get up to 80 90 100 when it gets that high what it's simply saying the rsi is saying that the market is overbought so any moment from now the market could reverse back now if i click okay if i click on the rsi you see this line that is appearing here okay and then i move it to the top of this area here so one thing i want you to pay attention this is what we are measuring this top here it says that at that point the rsi was what this is the where the rsi was it was 53 okay so for us to sell it has to be from that 50 the rsi should be from 50 and above then when the rsi is below 30 we buy when we, whenever we want to sell the rsi should be 50 and above that way we are going to be making profit okay now that is how the rsi work now another thing you want to look at is the chart if i scroll on the chart here okay you see that the crypto market doesn't move straight whether it is dogecoin bitcoin any coin of your choice i trade dogecoin because it is easier for me it makes profit for me faster so any coin of your choice it goes up it comes down it goes up it comes down so what you are doing is taking advantage of that using the rsi as you can see here this market came down to this level and then the rsi was here okay so if we measure this here if i measure this here okay um sorry if I measure this there you see that the rsi came down to as low as 40 or thereabout i've activated another indicator so um you know because it's on the app we may not be able to measure it but you should be able to always pay attention to these numbers okay you can buy from 30 below and then sell from 50 and above you'll be able to make profit so if you have entered this market somewhere around here okay buy here you would have sold around here and that would have been enough profit okay so that is basically how i use this to trade the spot market this is all you need to be able to make profit in the market this is all you need to be able to make profit in the market an example is with the current trade this is where the rsi went to and then bitcoin and the dogecoin drops to this is the price you can see the price that the dogecoin drops to 0 0.092877 that is what it drops to now if we have bought hundred dollar worth of dosh here and then sold at the current price okay the rsi is not even up to 50 yet but even if you have sold here you would have still made profit now to show you let me just show you okay this is where it drops okay let's assume that we bought at 0 0.093 okay let's just approximate these numbers are seen here to 093 
if I come back here, okay, let me go back to the option to buy. So what I would have done is at that point in time, you just come in here and use market order. All right. But let me just use limit to show you what is possible. So here on the limit option, we are assuming that this is where you set the price. Okay. This is the price, but this is the current price. As you can see, this tally with this. So we'll go ahead and delete that. And we are assuming that the mark we bought when the market gets to what? 0 0.09 we approximated it to 093 so 093 and then here is where i'm going to put the amount of usdt okay so i just put in let's say i bought dogecoin worth 100 usdt that means i would have gotten how much 1075 doge okay like this is what doge tokens this is the number of the doge token i would have gotten okay so if i go ahead and copy out this number all right the next thing is to come I come in here and click on you know the sell option so when i come to the sell option i will use limit order okay limit order in the sense that i don't want to sell at the current price when we use market order we are selling at the current price but when you use a um, uh, limit order we want to sell at the price higher than the current price okay so i'll use limit order then uh, but let's just assume that we are selling with this current price okay let's assume that we are selling with this current price so we assume that that is the price here. So we are going to paste that Dogecoin, the number of Dogecoin we bought. Okay. So if I go ahead and click and hold here. So I'll just paste that Dogecoin here. Once I paste that, you'll see that that with the current price right now, that would have given us $103. Okay. $103.55. So it means that in this transaction alone, you've made $3.55. All right. What if you wait for the RSI to get to 50? Now, when the RSI gets to 50, let me go back to that chart again. Now, when the RSI gets to 50, the price could be trading around here or living around here. Okay. If it gets to 0 0.099, that is another, you know, big money for yourself or big profit for yourself. So let's assume that we are selling at 0 0.099 or 0. Um, one for instance so if i go back to the sell option i come back to the sell option here okay let me go ahead and paste that number of dogecoin we copied before and then change this price here to 0 0.09 okay that would have been 106 okay 106 dollars what if i've changed it to 0 0.0 just 0 0.1 or 0 0.10 okay that would have been seven dollars and this thing is something you can do twice three times four times depending on how you know um, um you know free you are for the day you can do this two times three times four times in a day and you will be accumulating this profit for yourself okay so once you make profit the next time okay you don't just buy a hundred dollar worth of that you buy with the all the capital you have so if you have made a uh, hundred and seven dollars in this trade the next thing you want to buy a hundred and seven dollars worth of that particular token and wait for another opportunity to sell all right so this market you see here can go up down go up down as many times as possible in a day so it is very simple for you to make um ten dollars every day with just a hundred dollar in your account and gradually you can start growing that this is trading without leverage that is what spot trading is all about you are not losing any money even if the market goes down today beyond what you bought you still have that asset you bought for instance we bought a thousand 75 um dosh coin so if the market goes below what we bought we still have that 1075 all we just need to do is use the limit order and set the price at which we want to sell we wait for the market to go up at that point we'll sell and then we'll get back our money that we will repeat and uh, rings and repeat the process again and again this is very simple using the rsi go you know look at the rsi if there is anything you don't understand in it let me know in the comment section. You can equally join the Zoom, the Telegram group, okay? Join the Telegram group and ask your questions there and I'll see how best I can, you know, help you out with any of your, you know, questions and the rest. So if you have gained value from this video, give it a thumbs up, okay? And don't forget to leave a nice comment below. Um, that is it for this video. Once again, if you are new to the channel, consider subscribing. If you don't have an account with BitGet, you can trade on the spot market with zero fee. So make sure you sign off an account using the link I've left in the video description. That is it for this video and I will see you in the next video.